Hello, this is another tour about Jake, and I'm going to show you how to install a VBulletin forum today. And it's not too hard. When you first up, or, uh, upload it to your website, you'll get this. It says configuration. You'll need to fill out the data in config.php.new. And you have to rename it as well. So I'm going to go to includes. I'm just going to do a list view here. And I'm going to find our config.php.new. Which is in the end there. So first we're going to rename that to config.php I'm going to edit it and I'm going to scroll down So database name is bb youtube install And our password is, I'm just going to blow this out here And that's our password So once we save that we'll become to this page we'll need to go to what is install and install.php. Okay, once you do that you'll be asked to um, put in your customer number. I just find mine here. I will blur it out again because I don't want anyone getting my customer number really. Uh, the bulletin. Alright. So once we've got that we're gonna insert it there. And you'll be brought to this page. Once you're on this page, you'll click next step. Kung Fu file exists and is readable. And it's created the database for us. Now it's just creating our tables. So I'll just wait for that to complete. Okay, once that's done, we'll go to the next step and uh, create some more stuff. It's basically all you're doing on this one, you're just creating a lot of things. Into your form. It's really simple, you just go next. Okay, this is nine. Step. Ah, oh, this is step. Ah, oh, this is step nine. Okay, so this is our forums. Ah, uh, this is where it's all installed. Yes, it's fine. Obviously, you'll need to change some of that to whatever you want. My username, whatever, YouTube, uh, passwords, hello. Hello, hello, YouTube, YouTube uh, local host, yeah, we'll like that. Proceed. Administrator added, and there you go. And then you simply need to delete this. You need to go into your. Just find your install folder. And delete install PHP. And once you've done that, you can go to your admin CP, you can log in there, or you can go straight from 